examining the Chevrolet Colorado, our recently crowned 2024 Motor Trend Truck of the Year, one might instinctively divide its lineup into two categories, the robust off-road Colorado ZR2 and everything else. Without the ZR2's robust tires, contoured bumper corners, stern front end, and elevated ground clearance, the remaining Colorado models tend to blend together. It's easy to assume that the non, ZR2 Colorados are merely ordinary mid-size pickups intended for those who cannot afford the ZR2's extravagant features. However, such assumptions are challenged by the overarching emphasis on off-road capability across the new Colorado lineup, particularly exemplified by the budget-friendly Colorado Trail Boss. Thriving on a budget Formerly available as an option package, the Trail Boss treatment has evolved into a distinct trim level within the redesigned 2023 Chevrolet Colorado family. Positioned as the entry-level offering among the trio of more explicitly off-road-focused Colorados, sitting below the Z71 and formidable ZR2, the Trail Boss starts at a reasonable $38,495. To those unfamiliar with comparing a Trail Boss and the ZR2, it might appear as though it's merely a 2023 Colorado with a rugged black plastic grill, fender flares, and added bedside stickers. However, the Trail Boss boasts an impressive features list, including standard 32-inch all-terrain tires with optional mud terrains for $495, an automatic locking rear differential, front skid plate, 2.0-inch suspension lift, and a track with 3.0 inches wider than the Colorado WT and LT models. While four-wheel drive is optional on the WT and LT, the Trail Boss stands out as the first model in the price hierarchy to include standard four-wheel drive, a feature also present in the Z71 and ZR2. Additionally, it claims the title of the least expensive Colorado equipped with low-range gearing, distinguishing itself from the other trucks that only offer high-range 4WD settings. Every four-wheel drive Colorado benefits from an auto setting for the high range, automatically engaging 4WD when the system detects will slip. The Turbo Plus variant of the Chevy Colorado lineup, featuring the shared 2.7-liter turbo four-cylinder engine, packs a punch with 310 horsepower. However, it comes with a slightly lower torque output of 391 lbft, as opposed to the ZR2's 430 lbft figure. The base Colorados, on the other hand, come with a 237 horsepower, 260 LB, FT version of the same engine. Buyers opting for this mid-level configuration have the option to upgrade to the 430 LB, FT tuned through a $395 dealer-installed engine computer ref lash, fully covered by warranty. In the upcoming year, this mid-grade tune will no longer be necessary, making all 310 horsepower Colorados equipped with 430 LBFT of torque. Beyond the off-road hardware, there's an abundance of supportive software. Trail Boss models feature off-road and terrain drive modes, in addition to tow, haul, and eco modes. The terrain mode introduces a clever one-pedal driving feature, similar to electric cars, allowing the Colorado to come to a stop by simply lifting off the accelerator pedal. The aggressiveness of this one-pedal mode can be adjusted using the gear selection buttons on the shift lever. This feature proves extremely convenient when navigating over rocks, eliminating the need for left foot braking to manage each wheel's descent off obstacles like boulders and ditches. The package also includes hill descent control. Assessing its performance during a day at a southeastern Michigan off-road park carved from a semi-active rock quarry, the 2023 Chevrolet Colorado Trail Boss maintained composure. Even when compared to the plain Colorado LT, which surprised with its resilience despite less clearance, street-focused tires, and no low-range gearing. The experience highlighted the satisfying baseline competence of every new Colorado pickup truck in off-road conditions. The noticeable suspension lift of the Trail Boss contributed to reduced belly scraping, even when navigating through boulders or over logs with less meticulous line choices. The firm tuning of the dampers minimized head toss, and the innovative one-pedal setting in terrain mode stood out as a clever feature. It proved useful, especially considering the brake pedal tuning of the Colorado. While some may appreciate the brake pedal's firm action, it may require more leg effort than expected to keep the truck stationary when stopped. On several occasions, shifting from park to drive or reverse resulted in the Colorado moving forward or backward, indicating that our brake pressure was seemingly insufficient to hold the torque converter at bay. 
even surpassing its impressive off-road capabilities. The 2023 Chevrolet Colorado Trail Boss seamlessly integrates solid on-road driving dynamics present throughout the lineup. The ride is both comfortable and well-controlled, demonstrating excellent tracking on the freeway. Notably, the truck exhibits commendable steering response and maintains a flat profile during cornering, showcasing outstanding traits. These qualities may not immediately stand out in the 0.77 G average of lateral grip recorded on our skid pad, which, despite being favorable for off-roaders with similar tires, surpasses the performance of the previous Ford Ranger trimmer and Jeep Gladiator Mojave we've previously tested. Despite substantial pedal effort, the brakes deliver a strong performance, bringing the Trail Boss to a halt from 60 miles per hour in an impressive 121 feet, a solid achievement given the aggressive tire composition. Surprisingly, the low cabin noise defies expectations, even with the presence of aggressive all-terrain tires that remain subdued on pavement. In contrast, the turbo engine emerges as the single noisiest aspect, presenting a gravelly tone when pushed hard, although it remains muted during normal driving. The engine's power is without issue, with our Colorado Trail Boss test truck accelerating to 60 miles per hour in a brisk 6.1 seconds, propelled by satisfying low-down torque perfectly matched to the 8-speed automatic's gearing. Anticipate even quicker acceleration next year with 430 LBFT on board. Fuel economy, while acceptable, doesn't exhibit a significant improvement over the previous Colorado's 3.6-liter V6, regularly clocking in at 17 to 19 miles per gallon in our ordinary driving experiences. Despite these impressive features, the justification for the Chevy Colorado Trail Boss's place in the overall lineup extends beyond its hardware and off-road capabilities. Priced at a mere $815 more than a four-wheel drive Colorado LT with the same 310 horsepower engine and $3,080 more than a 310 horsepower WT 4x4. The Trail Boss delivers value. Admittedly, the cabin materials may lean toward basic WT specifications, featuring the smaller 8.0-inch digital gauge cluster instead of the 11.0-inch unit reserved for the Z71 and ZR2. In our test truck, cloth seats and a monochromatic black plastic dashboard and door panels were standard, providing a functional if not particularly lively aesthetic. For those seeking an upgrade, the Evitex full leather seat coverings prove a worthwhile $1,250 option over the standard scratchy, rental-grade cloth pieces. Chevrolet ensures that crucial touch points and viewpoints in the 2023 Colorado Trail Boss are robust. The displays provide sharp graphics, and the central touchscreen comes standard with Google built-in, an advanced package encompassing onboard Google Voice Search and Map functionalities usually reserved for top-tier trim levels by other automakers. Despite the absence of leather or full leather coverings, the steering wheel and door armrests offer a pleasing feel, ensuring that the elements you frequently touch and interact with convey a modern and decent quality aesthetic. While the touchscreen's headlight controls become familiar in regular use, it can be inconvenient to discover that the lights were left on upon exiting the truck. Rectifying this requires re-entry, pressing the start button, and waiting for the screen to boot up to turn off the lights, rather than a simple switch flick. Thanks for watching. Please like, share and subscribe if you like videos like this. Thank you.